Alicia Joyce again, and I'm thrilled that you're back with me today because what we're going to talk about are snacks plus quinoa. Super excited to show you these little things. They are the perfect little afternoon delight. After carpool, after running around, this is exactly what you need in your afternoon. So let's get started. Okay, so since we're talking snacks, let's be clear what a snack is. A snack is supposed to be a nutrient-dense little nibble that gets you between your regular meals. So between breakfast and lunch, you might have a snack. Between lunch and dinner, you might have a snack. And it's supposed to be something that's going to fend off your hunger, control your cravings, and keep you energized between your meals. So what I want to show you today fits the bill perfectly. And of course, since we're talking quinoa, each one of these dishes is going to incorporate that superfood for you. So before we do our blends, let me show you what we have. The three dishes I'm going to show you are super yummy. All of them include quinoa, like I said, although they all have a different uh, flavor base. The first one is going to be this little island delight that I want to teach you. It's going to have pineapple, coconut, and look at this little jar of yumminess, coconut milk. Delicious! The next thing I'm going to show you is a yogurt-based dish. And my goal in teaching you this one is really hopefully to convince you that you'll never ever need to buy flavored yogurt again. We're going to start with this plain whole milk yogurt and then to that I'm going to add some quinoa, I'm going to add my fresh pomegranates, and then I'm also going to add some honey in there. That is my absolute favorite, it's amazing. The last dish I'll show you is a cottage cheese based dish. For those of you that love a little cottage cheese in your day, we're going to add some blueberries to the cottage cheese but then we're going to also add in that quinoa, which is probably something you've never done, but I tell you, it is yum yum. Now the beauty of these dishes is they are quick, quick, quick. And that's the key too. I mean, for me as a mama, when I'm running through the door, I just need a little something, something. So I grab this stuff out and I want you to watch how quick this is to make these dishes. In each of these little cups, I'm going to put my third cup of quinoa. There's my base. No matter what I want to eat, it starts with that. So let's do my coconut island delight. Coconut milk. Doesn't that look decadent? Oh my goodness gracious. Fresh coconut. Here's my pineapple. There we go. Now it is winter, it is cold, it is dreary. Obviously I didn't go out and pick that pineapple off my tree. However, Trader Joe's, which is where I got, get most of my frozen fruit, they sell fruit in a bag, literally. No additives, no preservatives, no added sweeteners. So this is straight pineapple, as good as it gets from a tree, just frozen. Here we go, number two. We're gonna do our yogurt-based dish. This is so tart and so delicious. Oh my goodness, I crave this. A Little bit of yogurt in there. We're gonna do some pomegranate seeds that I broke out of my pomegranate today. And then, a little bit of honey. That is delicious, look at that. Number two, here we go. Number three, look, not even a minute, I've made up three little snacks. There we go, a little bit of cottage cheese in there, okay. Now I'm a big cottage cheese and fresh fruit girl. If this was summertime, we would have fresh strawberries, we would have fresh blueberries, raspberries, blackberries. This is one of those things that in the middle of the winter you use your frozen fruit just like this and then when you get to the summertime or when you can get fresh berries, anything fresh goes. Don't these look amazing? This one with these little chunks of frozen pineapple, seriously, it's like a frozen yogurt amazing blend. It's just delicious. It's like a, uh, no other better word other than afternoon delight. That's all I can think of. There's that one. Then look at this one. This one truly, it has this tart flavor to it and that honey just mm, balances it out. Gives you exactly what you need. And of course, you could throw any sort of fruit in here. I happen to like the pomegranates just because anytime I can use pomegranates is a great thing. But you could throw any sort of fruit in there. And then this last one, same thing. When you can eat cottage cheese and berries, even better to have the quinoa in it. And let's talk about that. I mean, why would you want to throw quinoa into these snacks? Um, and the reason is this, because quinoa has the extra punch of protein, but you're also getting tons of fiber in your quinoa. One cup of quinoa is actually close to 20% of your day's fiber. So if you can add fiber into the protein of the dairy 
It's just more satiating. It's really going to satisfy you longer to have a blend of the carbs, the proteins, and fats that these would give you versus just straight yogurt and fruit. So if you're a yogurt and fruit person or a cottage cheese and fruit person, you know that. It doesn't satisfy very long. The added quinoa will definitely carry you through. Okay, but you're on the go. And obviously, like I said, these three things are great if you're running in and out the door and you have access to your fridge. But what do you do to get quinoa when you're out on the go? That's what I struggled with. And so I came up with Smarty Bars. And so, of course, I can't talk about quinoa snacks without talking about my delicious, absolutely fabulous whole food energy snacks. These are Smarty Bars. Quinoa is in our Smarty Bars. Smarty Bars start with a fruit base, and then to that we have the quinoa, we have gluten-free oats, and we have walnuts. So when you're sitting at home, you get to eat this goodness. When you're out on the go, you grab one of these and you get to eat this goodness. So that's it, whole foods, super snacks. So come on back, visit me tomorrow. Tomorrow we're gonna do a big wrap up on quinoa. We've covered how to make it. We've covered how to use it in breakfast, power lunches, and now today's snacks. Tomorrow I just talk, wanna talk about all of the good things about quinoa that we really haven't covered this week. So come back, visit with me, we'll chit chat. Thanks for visiting.